Hey guys, and welcome back to yet another video. So I'm very excited because I may be the first YouTuber um, to actually find all the Warden Shrines. So I'm just going to jump in and show you guys all the different locations for um, all of them, but one, they're all going to be on land. So I recommend a flying creature. There's only one that's going to be in the water and that's the Egen Warden. Um, but we're going to use the Bruquek, Bru Bruquek. I think I never know how to pronounce this guy's name, but we're going to use this guy because he's like the speediest one. So there we go. I'm not going to go in order just because um, it's just going to be whatever's closest. So first off, we've already spawned right next to it. And this is the Ardor Warden um, statue, which is in the swamp area. So here we go. It looks very nice. It has this like water coming down on the flower petal. And I don't know, it looks nice. It looks so cute. Anyway, so let's move on to the next one. We are going to go to the Angelic Warden Shrine, which is going to be over here in this uh, jungle area. Is it a jungle? I always forget sometimes. So it's going to be over here. You got to go in the back. Is it this one? I always forget sometimes. Oh, is it this one? Okay, it's this one. You want to go over here in the back near the end of the world. Literally, if you look on the map, the end of the world. It's going to be over here with this brown ledge. And if you go over here, you can see this like runestone writing um, stuff. But if you go through it, voila, you can see the angelic warden shrine, which looks very nice. With the wings and everything. And it's, it's holding the orb, which looks very nice. Oh, and there's also this over here. Let me go and get this. There we go. I didn't even know that was there, to be honest. Anyway, so we're going to get out. And we're going to go to the next one. We're going to go to the Gara Warden. Now this one's probably the easiest one just because it's like so obvious. But the Gara Warden Shrine is going to be inside of the volcano over here. So let's make our way. It's going to be in the back over here. Oops. And there we go. So there's the Gara Warden. All red and evil looking with its gnarly looking teeth. But there we go. And we're going to head off to the next one, which is the Novus, which is actually right near the Gara Warden Shrine, which is going to be up here on these. Don't go to the other islands. It's going to be this one, the Grass Islands, or whatever you want to call them. It's going to be up here on the tallest one. This is going to be the Novus Warden. I think this one's kind of sad. I don't know why. Like, I can't tell if the Novus is sleeping or if it's like... I don't know, possibly dead, but it just looks so nice the way it's like laying down. Anywho, and then we're gonna go to the next one, which is right over here at Flower Cove. It's also going to be in the back. And this one over here is gonna be the Verdant Warden statue or shrine, whichever you wanna call it. Ooh, what is this? Galaxy? Anyway, so here we go. I keep calling them, um, statues but i think they're called shrines i'm not sure to be honest shrine statue statue shrine but here's the verdant warden now we're gonna go to helion warden um, and this one's going to be in the mesa biome or the desert if you want to call it that so if you go over here and you go underneath these like arches and then right over here you go under this like tunnel area and you go over here it doesn't matter which hole you go into because it goes in the same like direction but here you go helion warden now this is the only one that has chains i don't know why for some reason i don't i'm not like knowledgeable with the lore and stuff but i don't know why helion's the only one that's like chained up it's kind of sad but i mean it might have something to do with the backstory anyway so that's helion this is going to be the most like noticeable one. Boreal is going to obviously be in the tundra biome and it's actually over here next to this. Is it this one? No, it's over here. It's next to this arch over here. And it's actually right here, this giant opening right here. And if you go in, boom, Boreal Warden. And just like in the previous map or the legacy map, it has like this pond thing underneath. but. There's Boreal, or Boreal, I don't know how you pronounce it. So that's all for the land ones, I believe. So we did Angelic, we did Gara, we did Novus, 
we did Helion, Boreal, Ardor. So now we are going to do the final one, which is going to be the Aegean one. Now this one by far was the difficult, like the most difficult shrine for me to find. Like I legit went and found every single shrine before making this video. And it took me over like three hours to find the Aegean shrine and I was so excited when I found it. That was so difficult. And it turns out I was actually passing the shrine like numerous times and I didn't even realize it. We're gonna play as Namuna by the way because it's the fastest like sea creature and the stamina regions like really f quick. But anyway, so if you go on your map and you go right here kind of in the center and you go down you can see if you go so it might be difficult to like locate where it is but if you go over here where these like plants are it's kind of like circled by this like white sand colored looking thing if you go down here it's actually a secret door and boom there you go the Aegean Warden Shrine this one actually scared me the first time because it was so huge I was expecting it to be like this giant i mean it's a statue but i wasn't expecting it to be so huge it's bigger than like all the other statues in my opinion but yeah there you go and there's this giant mouth thing over here but that's pretty much all the statues so if that helped you guys and you were looking desperately well here you guys go hope you guys enjoyed please like the video it took me so long to find all these shrines i mean not like half of them but definitely the Aegean one took me over three hours so please if you could just like the video please and maybe subscribe and um, that's pretty much it i hope you guys have a nice day and i'll see you guys in the next video bye